Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to use your Android phone as your remote control for any Roku device. Roku TVs and Roku streaming devices. So first, make sure both your Roku and your phone are connected to the same Wi-Fi connection. Then go to Google Play Store, App Store if you have an iPhone, go to search, search for Roku app there is only one Roku official app you can use third-party apps but it's not a guarantee that it's gonna work so I'm gonna go with the Roku app official install it So once the application is installed, you just open it. Tap continue. Next. Next. Allow. Continue as guest. If you cannot log in with your uh, email address, with your Roku account, just continue as guest so i'm going to go to remote once you press remote you will see your devices your roku devices or your roku tv to log in you just press your device to connect connect now allow so this is the remote you can also connect a wired or a wireless headphone. You can tap once to enable private listening here. As you can see the icon on my TV or turn it off. You can either connect wireless headphones or wired like this. If you want to know how to connect wireless headphones to your Roku TV, check the link and the description. So once you connect your headphones, you just press this icon here to enable speakers on your TV. You just turn off private listening. Enable, disable, enable, disable. So I'm going to go back to the remote, remote. You can use the arrows. You can press OK. You can go back to the apps. You can open an application here. Let's go to YouTube. For example, once you press the application, it's going to open on your TV. The home button. Settings. You can also turn off. It depends on your Roku device. You can also turn off your Roku and turn it back on. This is the power button. That's how it works with the Roku remote. Please subscribe if it's the first time you're watching my videos. See you on the next one.